I don't want to talk anymore, sir. I, I'm, a, I'm asking you again sir. to please remove. I am an unarmed citizen in my home. Sir. I'm asking you, sir, to please remove your foot because that's to me that's threatening, sir. So again, threatening. sir, I'm asking you, please. This is you're you're now in my home. Sir. You sir. are a public listen. servant, okay. I, sir. I understand that. Sir. It is me and my son, okay. and I'm asking you, okay. you to please remove okay. your foot. You're you not coming in my home. Okay, just listen. That's, there's nothing else to listen to. You're not coming in my home. Sir. I'm asking you to please leave. I'm not going to close my door and continue with my day. Okay. You guys have a good day, officer. Okay. Have a good... Uh -huh. Sir, do that, sir. sir. Sir, this is my home. <laughs> sir, this is my home. Discover the shocking truth in our latest video. Corrupt cops enter the wrong house and refuse to leave. Join us in raising awareness by subscribing, liking, and sharing on our YouTube channel. U.S. Corrupt Cops. Let's unite against corruption. On June 13th in 2020, two officers from the Arlington Police Department answered a call reporting a disturbance. The caller stated they heard a man and a woman arguing, accompanied by the sound of breaking glass. During their investigation, the officers went to the apartment of Christopher Finley, a local father in Arlington, Texas. While the sequence of events following the officer's approach to Mr. Finley's door remains unclear, as soon as one officer placed his foot in the doorway, Mr. Finley initiated filming of The Encounter and live streamed it on Facebook. I don't want to talk anymore, sir. I, I'm, a, I'm asking you again sir. to please remove. I'm an unarmed citizen in my home. Sir, I'm asking you, sir, to please remove your foot because that's to me that's threatening, sir. So again, not sir, I'm asking you, please. This is you're you're now in my home. Sir, you sir, are a listen, public listen. servant, okay. I, sir. I understand that. Sir. It is me and my son, okay, and I'm asking you, okay. can you listen, to please remove your okay. foot. Can you listen. You're not coming in my home. Okay, just listen, listen, sir. That's there's nothing else to listen to. You're not coming in my home, sir. I'm asking you to please leave. I'm not going to close okay. my door and continue with my day. Okay. You guys have a good day, officer. Okay. Have a good, well, sir. Do that, sir. Sir, sir this is my home. <laughs> sir, this is my home. I am Was no longer speaking with you. You are not needed in this home. Was there a disturbance? I am no longer speaking with you. Sir, we we're not asking. We're not Have a good say, sir. Sir, again. We're not telling again, you. officer. Again, please remove your foot out of my home. Okay. Was there a disturbance here? I am no longer communicating with you, sir. We're just trying to make sure. I'm telling you that I do not need you guys. We're not saying it is me and my son, and I'm telling you. I'm, I'm now. I'm not in trouble. But I'm telling you that it is me and my son, and I would like for you to okay, remove where, your foot. Where is your wife? I, I don't have to answer any questions to you, sir. So okay, now I'm wait. asking you again, let me, remove let me, your foot out of my home. I don't want to speak anymore, sir. Okay, let me have a good day. I don't need you. I don't, I'm not asking you. I am in my home. Okay, I'm not asking you. My, son, my son is fine. I am fine. We are the only people that are occupying this residence. You are trespassing as of right now because I have asked you several times to remove your foot out of my home. So at this time, public servant, you are trespassing. So one more time, sir, I'm going to ask you to remove your foot out of my home and have a good day, officer. Mr. Finley is claiming that a cop trespassed by sticking his foot in the doorway, citing section 30.05 of the Texas Penal Code. This law says trespassing involves the whole body entering, so a foot alone doesn't cut it. Even if it did, there's a defense if the person reasonably thought they had permission, especially for cops under section 9.21. In the rare chance of a trespass charge, the cop's foot in the door probably wouldn't count, and they could argue they thought they were allowed by law. Thank you. Goodbye, sir. No, no, no. Hold on. Sir, sir, sir. Sir, get away from my door. We gotta make sure sir, okay. sir, I'm feeling attacked at this moment. I'm, I'm not asking attacking you, you man. You're, you're in my residence. I am not giving you permission to enter my residence. So if you want to enter my residence, go back to your station, okay. speak to your captain and All judge. Right. Say, okay. sir, sir, this Move is on aside. live. Move aside. Sir, okay. get out of the No, 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 don't touch my phone. Move aside. CJ, close that door, son. Move aside. I'm telling you not to enter my residence without a warrant, sir. Well, without a warrant. A sir, you're not entering my residence. This is my home. That I am unarmed. I am peaceful and in my residence. I'm asking this man to remove his foot from my home. This is my domicile. I have the right to I have the right to refuse. That's it. Sir, again. And I'm telling you that everyone in here is fine. Again, sir. No, I'm not, sir. This is my home. You are trying to invade my home. You're trying to invade my home. You're looking at the residence. I'm well. We got Sir, you will not, you're not going to enter my home. You do not have a warrant. You will not enter my home. Please remove your foot from my door. So that I can go back and chill with my son, sir. Sir, we just gotta sir, make sure your wife is okay. Sir, okay? there's no one in this home, sir. There is no one in this home besides me and my child. Point blank, period. Okay. If you want to come in my home, then I, with all rights, once you come back with a, a signed warrant, 
from a Tarrant County judge, you will be more than welcome. Like I Please, said, we're not sir. Gonna do a search or anything. Sir, we gotta I, do, we gotta do a sir let me tell you something. I am a very legal citizen. I'm not worried about any no, of that. But not. again, you don't that. have permission to enter my home. Like I said, we're doing. We're you will not enter my home. Welfare, You're looking at. You are looking at the resident of this home. I'm looking you in your eye and telling you I'm well. This is where this ends, sir. You're not entering my home. And again, at this point, you really violating my rights with your foot in my property. Mr. Finley repeatedly told the cops that they couldn't come into his home without his permission or a warrant. But despite that, one officer stuck his foot in the door, preventing Mr. Finley from closing it. The Fourth Amendment generally says that searches and seizures in a home without a warrant are a no-go. Past court cases like Peyton v. New York 1980 and Kilo v. United States 2001 have made it clear that a warrant is needed to enter someone's home. The Tenth Circuit Court of Appeals, Dr. v. City of Lakewood 2012, and a U.S. District Court in Georgia, Haney v. City of Woodstock 2008, have said that even a small entry, like putting a foot in the doorway, counts as entering the home, according to the Constitution. However, Texas law, which requires a complete entry to violate trespassing rules, adds a wrinkle. The 2020 case Gorski v. Harris County in Texas said it's not definitively known if sticking a foot in the door to extend a consensual encounter breaks the Fourth Amendment. So, while the officer might argue he didn't fully enter Mr. Finley's place under Texas law, the officer could also claim qualified immunity based on the 2020 case, making it possible for a court to side with the officer if Mr. Finley sues for a violation of his civil rights. I don't have to. You are a public servant. I don't have to listen to you. You knocked on my door. I'm not asking you for an explanation. I didn't call y'all to tell me to come give y'all. I didn't tell y'all to come give me an explanation. Sir, we got a call to this location. Sir, you didn't here. get a call to this location. Then you did not get a know, call to this location. Address Sir, okay, look. I, I'm not going to do this with you. Again, I'm asking you to remove your foot off of my property now. So you're going to continue to violate my rights, officer. Sir, I'm not violating you. You are. Rights. This is my property. You do not have a sign warrant, and your foot is in my property. You just saw my son, and you saw me. That's the only people in this residence. If you want to come to my home, feel free to come back with a, a, a sign warrant from the Tarrant County Judge. Sir, yeah, I'm being I'm very rational. So, we're telling him we want to do a welfare check and make sure his wife's okay. Okay, we got call for There is no wife in this home. Listen, we have to make sure. Sir, I, and again, I said, I, I said, no, sir. I said, with a sign warrant, you will be able to enter my home. There is me and my child in this. There is only me and my child in this home. Okay. No, sir, no, sir, because you are okay. Well, I'm tell your deputy first no. of all, tell your deputy no, to remove his. Have, so, you gotta, have so you got to continue to trespass on my property, yes, sir. We're gonna make on sure my property, okay. CJ. Come to the door again, baby boy. This is as far as you're going to come in my home. CJ, is there anybody in there? Is there anybody in there, sir? Are you harmed, son? You're fine, okay? Don't be scared, sir. Okay, so go back in the room and close the door, okay, baby? I love you. It's okay. That's as far as he's going to go. You're not entering my residence, sir. Without a sign warrant from a Tarrant County judge, I am not permitting you to enter my dwelling. We don't need a warrant. No, okay. sir. Yes, you do, sir. With existing circumstances, to welcome there is no. Sure okay. You looked at the two. You looked at. You looked at the two accompanied residents in this home. There is no one else in this home. There has been no one else in this home. So again, sir, it, this is making me feel very threatened because you are trespassing. We're not trespassing. You We're are trespassing, sure. sir. In this situation, cops show up at Mr. Finley's place after getting a call about a domestic dispute. The boss says they don't need a warrant to enter because of what they call exigent circumstances based on the call. Mr. Finley says he doesn't have a wife, only his son is there. The legal argument is about whether there was a real emergency justifying the entry without a warrant. They're looking at past Supreme Court cases like Mincy v. Arizona, Brigham City v. Stewart, and Georgia v. Randolph for guidance. Since there aren't clear signs of danger, similar to the Osborne case, it raises doubts about whether the cops had a legal reason to enter without a warrant. The key question is whether the court will agree that the officers had a valid basis for thinking there was an urgent situation at Mr. Finley's place. 
Sir, Listen, what sir. what this door stops? What this door stops sir, is my property. I'm not willing to walk away without sir, knowing knowing. Our, sir, okay, okay? sir, you can have an officer monitor my door and go get a warrant. We but without a warrant, sir, okay. you are not entering my residence, sir. Okay. No, sir, I'm nobody is entering work. my home, sir. Okay, I'm giving you one chance, sir. That I can work with you. Work I know my or rights. Just gonna go in there and and if you do that, sir, I okay. swear to you, sir, I have 351 people on live who have witnessed I that I have not given you but permission to enter my home. No, sir, I'm cleaning up my home. I don't trust you officers. I do not go? trust you and I have the right. These are my property. You're, you're, this is my property. Not me I'm not young. I'm, I'm, I'm trying sir. to give you, I'm trying to give sir, you I'm not young. Because, you sir, not you until not sense? until you not until you and your officer stop trespassing on my property. Okay. I will hold my door right open. Now, you me an sir, you're gonna hold your door open sir, I, Okay, again, I am verbally verbally affirming to you sir. that when you remove your when you remove your foot off of my property, I will hold my door ajar to speak with you. Stop trespassing on my property that I will stand here with my door ajar and sir, communicate listen. with you. But until then, sir, I feel very okay. threatened I'm and I'm not willing. Sir, just let me talk for 10 sir. seconds. Sir, okay. okay. That, that, more sir, that is how we can okay. speak, sir. Sir. And this came out as a possible sir. domestic disturbance. That domestic disturbance between me and my okay. son. Well, CJ, sir. close the door, baby. It's okay. Please close yeah. the door, son. This is crazy, man. Okay. Like, this is crazy. My son is crying, bro. You. You're not coming in my home, man. Actually, right now, I see broken glass. So that's yeah, you see broken glass. My son dropped his snack bowl. Okay. And we didn't make my son dropped his snack bowl. My son dropped his snack bowl. That oh wow, Buddy, sir. We get a call for domestic disturbance. Sir, we have to check. So that's what we're doing. Sir, let me tell you. I, I have a, it's me. Can we see your son? And my, see his face. Make sure he just okay. did. Oh my God, y'all. Yeah, this is what y'all want to expose my son to. Listen, CJ, no sir. Because I'm gonna. No sir. I'm gonna. I'm gonna honor his request. Come here, son. Come here. Come here, son. Come here, son. Okay. Good. CJ, son, sorry, is there, so, sir, you don't have permission to speak to my son. So, okay. CJ, y'all gonna, hey, hey, gonna do this in front of my child? Y'all gonna do this in front of my child? Y'all gonna do this in front of my child? Y'all are gonna do this in front of my child, bro? Stop hurting your child. Stop hurting your child. Y'all gonna do this in front of my child, bro? Go in the room. CJ, go in the room. Y'all really gonna do this in front of my child, bro? Y'all doing this in front of my child? Bro, say, let me go. Let me go and get out of my home. Let me go and get out of my home. Let me go and get out of my home. Let me go and get out of y'all while I'm finna shoot out of all you. Move away from my son. CJ, 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 be quiet. Do not say anything, child. Y'all violate my rights. I'm on y'all mother. Get out of my home, and I got all you badges. Get out of my home, boy. 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 Is he cut? I'm, I'm, a blood, I'm a good right black father, son. I, I don't put my hands on my son. Is it blood on my son? Blood. That ain't blood. I got a dog, dummy. A That's no blood. And there's blood. That's a snack bowl. You see the snacks, dummy? That's a snack bowl. I have a dog, dum dum. Oh, y'all you just violated my rights. Get the out of my house. Get the out of my house. Arlington police entered Mr. Finley's apartment without a warrant, claiming there were urgent circumstances. Mr. Finley later said on Facebook, that the officers followed him in his truck, leading the police department to promise a further investigation. The officers left the apartment without pressing charges after making sure Mr. Finley and his son were safe. Despite the potential Fourth Amendment issues, the officers seemed genuinely concerned about safety. The incident shows the challenges officers face in applying legal rules like exigent circumstances Mr. Finley is commended for standing up for his Fourth Amendment rights. However, the complexity of legal standards and the information officers have highlights the difficulties both sides encounter in understanding their rights and responsibilities. Speak out against police corruption. Subscribe, like, and share the video. Corrupt cops enter the wrong house and refuse to leave on the YouTube channel. U.S. Corrupt cops to spread the message of justice. Let's raise awareness about this incident and advocate for social change.